I had a nice evening yesterday and today is a lovely day. Really great weather to start term with. Unfortunately, I just need to sit and write my dissertation today. I've got no other plans. My dissertation word count is up to 5,000 words, so that means I'm now halfway. Deadline is in about three weeks. Got another 5,000 words to write by then. I'll do some more after dinner. booking the formal hall for Wednesday, the computer science one. I don't usually go every week, um, but since it's the first one of term and there might not be another one after this, I don't know. I'll, I'll go along. I think I'm going to put in the special requirements section for the meal, no fish, because obviously I do not trust the buttery not to serve salmon. I really don't like salmon, if you haven't heard me say this before. But I just feel stupid getting given a little card saying no fish. Because the other requirements, it's like if you're vegetarian or if you've got an allergy or if it's something you can't eat for religious reasons, I don't think there's any, like, real reason why you would get no fish. <laughs> Apart from just not liking it. I guess it's better than getting a meal that I don't want to eat. Oh, Roger left his coat here. I'll have to give that back to him. I'm up to 5,500 words of my dissertation. I'm probably going to keep giving you an updated word count, not that you care. Currently on the implementation section of my dissertation, where I'm literally just going through every class that I wrote and explaining why it exists, what it does, and how it does it. I don't know if that's how I'm meant to be doing this. Never really been taught how to write a dissertation. 12 o'clock, time to start thinking about bed. Somebody has written on the windowsill. It's like scratched in. I'm not really sure what it says. I do not understand why an adult, an educated, intelligent adult at a university like this would vandalise and graffiti on the windowsill in either their bedroom or somebody else's bedroom. The buttery are so slow at updating the menu on the website. We always get halfway through the week before the menu is right. So tonight will be another surprise. I really love nice weather like this, but it does make it a bit harder to concentrate because I just want to be outside. Lots of people prefer to revise when it's sunny and the weather's good, but I prefer cloudy, dull days because then there's nothing to distract me. I can sit and I can work and there's nothing else that I want to do instead. I mean, there is, but I, I don't look outside and just want to go and sunbathe. Like lots of people are, there are people just out here all day. This is one of the few bits of grass nearby that you can actually walk on. They're generally quite strict in Cambridge colleges about keeping off the grass. But in this term, this bit of grass, you can go and sit on it. Everybody's finally cleared from the, the grass down there, so I've got some peace. I haven't got much work done today, I'm disappointed with myself. But it's important not to give up midway through the day because you haven't done much work so far. It's very easy to, say, sleep in on a morning and wake up at 10 o'clock and be like, oh no, the day's ruined, I can't work now because I meant to get up at 7 o'clock to stick to my plan. No, just adapt your plan. Start from when, whatever time it is. It's, it's not too late. So don't give up. 6pm, I can do 5 hours of work after dinner. Speaking of dinner, the buttery finally updated the menu and it looks horrible today, so a few of us are going to go to a pub for dinner because we don't really want the buttery spinach curry. The last time we went to this pub was a couple of years ago and we got some flavoured shots and my shot had ants in it. So I wasn't left with the best impression of this pub having downed a shot with ants in the bottom of the glass. Hopefully that doesn't happen tonight. The pub is called the Granter, by the way. Mm -hmm. It was good, no ants. Back to work now, though. This last term was my food and snack shop of things like flapjacks and biscuits. But it meant I could always see food on the shelf and I was always tempted to snack. So I've replaced the food with cameras instead so I'm more tempted to vlog and film things. 
But I moved the food to this drawer, which means when I'm sitting at my desk doing work, chocolate is always within arm's reach, so I may have made the snacking situation worse. I just got the last vlog from last term edited. I uploaded that this week. Really sad watching that last bop again. Every bop ends with this song as well, Hey Jude. And that's the last one, no more. I hope you enjoyed that vlog. And I hope you've enjoyed this vlog as well. Thanks for watching.